It is the final round of the McKenzie Investments Open presented by Jaguar Laval. Ryan Williams, who has a sponsor's invite to next week's RBC Canadian Open, sticks it close and brings it on back on the fourth. He goes on to make birdie in route to his PGA Tour debut next week. He shot eight under on Sunday. Matt Picanso from 280 yards bends it around the trees and plays the break perfectly on the final hole. Then goes on to sink the eagle putt to finish his day at two under, nine under total, finished at T14. Jared Detroit who's also playing in the RBC Canadian Open on the PGA Tour next week. His approach on the 18th. These guys know how to play the break on that final green. Sinks his putt for birdie to end his day at 10 under, his second top 10 of the season. Jonathan Garrick, UCLA alum, his approach on the 7th. Very nicely done, goes on to make the birdie. Finishes up with a 66. Rico Hoey, USC alum, with his final putt of the day for birdie and a 65. Daniel Kim, the Freedom 55 Financial Canadian Player of the Week. His approach on the ninth, sticks it close. Goes on to make birdie and finishes with a 68 T2. But Hank Lebiota, it was his tournament all week long. His putt on four for birdie to get to 17 under. The 23-year-old there on 15 with his approach makes that to get to 19 under. And on 18, his approach shot sets him up with a winning putt. It was no contest as he walks up 18 to capture his first professional Victory. He is now sixth on the Latino America and McKenzie for his order of merit. The eight stroke victory matches the PGA Tours era record for largest margin of victory. Jordan Smith, not the only 23 year old winning this week.